I'm Larry Penn, a reporter for the Vancouver Sun. I'm here at uh, Sunset Marina on the uh, border with uh, Lions Bay in West Vancouver. Over the next several days, I'm going to be paddling uh, solo from here to the Canada-US border at White Rock and uh, seeing what kind of uh, people and landscapes I find along the way. Paddling allows an exclusive peek into the world of affluence. West Vancouver boasts some of the wealthiest waterfront homes in Canada, more than 60 worth at least $10 million apiece. On my journey, I connected with Mike Rugamer, who builds homes for some of Metro Vancouver's wealthiest. The appeal of building homes in the water is you wind up having a breathtaking view every day at lunchtime, and you have a wonderful scenery, there's nobody blocking views, and the fact that uh, you're at one with nature at all times. Typically, with all the houses that are being built on the waterfront, the biggest concern is always having unobstructed views of the water, the foreshore, and possibly of any islands that can be seen from the house. So windows and lots of floor-to-ceiling glass is typical. The motivation for me, predominantly, is building people's dream houses and seeing them actually come to life when I actually hand the keys over to the clients and seeing their faces beaming from ear to ear with the gratitude and also with the respect of the fact that it's taken as long as it has to build these houses because they're not crackerjack boxes. People that want waterfront homes typically want the absolute best of everything. 